Hello there and welcome back to the channel. Welcome back to this director of football save with PSG in Football Manager 2021. 2022 has been announced. It's coming out on the 9th of November. So hopefully we will get the beta a couple of weeks before that. Cannot wait. Bring it on. Um, bit of a bonus this week. Uh, was expecting to start season three. Instead, we have the Club World Championship. Now I'd completely forgotten about this. Um, so the we were we obviously we won it last season, um, and that was because in in real life they got to that final when they had a little mini tournament in Portugal, didn't they? And they lost to Bayern, but that would have been why they were in the the one that we won. This one is because we got to the final last season, I imagine. Uh, sorry, we got to the final and won it in the first season of the save. Um, we didn't get to the final last season. Uh, we spunked out massively in that one. Um, so what it is, it's an expanded tournament. It should have happened in the summer of 2021 in real life, but obviously the Euros happened. Pushed back to 2022. Um, so these are the groups. I think one of... I think we, Are we the only group... Oh no, every group started. Uh, we haven't played yet. We have got America from Mexico and Atletico Mineiro from Brazil. Uh, we've also got Juve and Flamengo, um, is that Palmeiras, Real Madrid, Liverpool and Boca. Um, Tottenham are in there and we're already through. Uh, you've got Bayern who should go through. They got a draw. They got a draw against Gremio. That's bizarre. Um, so basically the winners of Group A will play the winners of Group B. Winners of Group C will play the winners of Group D and so on. So we are in Group E. We will play the winners of Group F, which probably will be Liverpool, considering that they've beaten Boca. So, yeah, that's um, that's how that works. Uh, so, Juventus have beaten Cruz Azul by two goals to one. This isn't bringing out the big results I expected it would do. I thought teams from Europe would be really, really killing it, but then they're not. Um, Let's just have a quick look through the team. This has kind of snuck up on me a little bit. So I'm just having a quick look through the team. Uh, let's have a look. Neymar, Mbappe, Sarabia. Leon Bailey can come in for a start. We've got plenty of options on the bench. Um, because obviously we can have 12 as opposed to 7. So we will have a keeper on the bench. Diallo can go in there. Which means we've got two subs. Danilo isn't registered apparently i don't remember registering players for it at all to be honest uh i, I think it's just a case of whoever we've got um why is pablo sarabia unhappy wants a new contract okay well that's nothing to do with me you're coming to you're barking up the wrong tree if you're coming for me for a contract son uh right that is i can only have 11 by the look of it then Okay, that's fine. That is fine. That is fine. We'll have 11 players. Not a problem. Uh, so that is about as strong as I can get, really. So we will go for it. Um, my director of football has, a, has arranged a transfer. Um, but I will, do, uh, I will bring you that in the transfer update uh, at the start of the season. It's not a massive one. It's, it's quite a, a confusing one, actually. But right. Let's get into this. Hander Herrera's recent injury problems. Yes. Um, do I actually know? I, I didn't even look where this has been played. Haven't got a clue. What formation are America playing? Let's have a look. So they are doing a 4 1 4 1. That could be a bit annoying. Uh, let's bring up their formation. Oh, we've got a highlight straight away. Florentino Luis across to Verratti. Tolisso. Nice play. Oh, I thought Neymar might have whipped one there, but he's come for Jao Cancelo, who's crashed it off the crossbar. Good start, though. Good start. Did think Neymar might have whipped that one in. Uh, why have America had more shots on target than us? Cleared away. We just wait on this. Mbappe, oh, beautiful finish. Gone down as his first goal of the season, so it's been classed as a pre-season tournament rather than a, an end-of-season tournament. 
This ball though, wonderful. What a touch, instant finish, right into that near post. An inch to the left, and that's coming back out again. Come on then, lads. We're well on top now. Seven shots, 70% possession as well. Leon Bailey is tired. I'm going to drop a praise in. I've started doing that a lot when we're winning. No matter when it is in the game. Um, I just It seems to help. Seems to keep them going. Normally, if we were if we were two or three up, I would praise them in the last ten minutes on a job well done. But it, it does seem to fire them up. It does seem to motivate them a bit. Oh, I thought Neymar... I thought he was just going to take the roof of the net off with that. Poor finish in the end. Doesn't get a good enough contact on it. Neymar. Lovely ball in! Leon Bailey. He's looking absolutely knackered. I forgot to check his condition. I think he was with Jamaica. So I think, yeah, I think he's absolutely goosed. Oh, the keeper. Don't know what he's doing there. Don't know what the keeper's doing there. He's absolutely... Well, dropped a clanger there, hasn't he? Cleared away. Martinez. Suarez. Kept hold of the ball. Did well. Oh. They're dwelling on it a little bit. It's played forward and they've lost it. They went. They were going far too slowly. They had far too many touches on the ball. And Verratti. Lovely little jinking run. We are absolutely all over them. I mean, a win in this game is, is critical. Uh, because Atletico Minera will be the other team that feel like they can maybe get through as Joao Cancelo with a very, very tidy finish. And again, it's the assist. All three goals, it's been about the assist. Look at this pass. Beautiful little clip. It allows the early finish. And the game's out of sight. Yeah, Atletico, if, uh, four points in a, in a, in a three-team group is enough to get through, uh, clearly. So... Yeah, it's, uh, it's important to get that win on the board. Uh, and it does basically put America out as well. Oh, that's terrible. They've given it away. Leon Bailey. Cancelo. Is it four before the break? Oh, Verratti it is. 4-0. Come on, lads. A really good finish. Good spot from Bailey there, but it was Tolisso couldn't get to it. But it was a very, very poor, very, very loose clearance. Now absolutely smacked in by Marco Verratti. And this one is job done, lads. Job done. I could possibly... Um, drop all the pace down and, and just let them have a breather but I mean look at all these play players that are um, looking complacent as well I mean I'm going to be like Gareth Southgate here I think and not make any changes apart from the one that I've had to do there with Coleman coming on for Bailey twenty one shots we've had Possession's gone down now. It's at sixty percent. Coleman will get to that. Wow, that's a thumping ball. Was that saved? Did that hit the post? I think it was a save. It was a thunderous effort. Okay, we'll bring his eye on for Jao Cancelo. Why not? Oh, Mbappe missed it. Valdez was running in treacle there. He's carrying a knock. And it just looked like Mbappe just had to get to the ball. They've given it away again. And it's Neymar slipping it through. And it's Mbappe to finish. It's 5-0. 
and Mbappe is on course for a hat-trick, but I want to bring him off. Terrible pass across. Neymar got to it. Timing of the pass, timing of the run, weight of the pass. No more than you would expect from two of the best players on the planet. Um, I'm going to have to take off Verratti and Luis by the look of it. Oh, I can't make... No, of course, because we did one already, haven't we? Okay, so just Paredes for Verratti then. Let's drop another little praise in there. Why not? Why not? I like having green faces on at the bottom there. We've only got a couple of game, couple of days till the next match. And it might just be a case of putting them all on rest. Oh, is that going to be a penalty? It looks like it should be. Apparently we have VAR. It is a penalty. It's got to be Mbappe. Got to be Mbappe for the hat-trick. Up he steps. Oh, never in doubt. Never in doubt. Killing Mbappe with the hat-trick. It's 6-0. Beautiful. You are not saving that. Time for more. Oh, Coleman. What a ball in from Neymar. Gave it some beans, didn't he? Look at that. And Coleman glances it wide. I thought it was off his head originally, but it wasn't. He got his boot on it. Very, very good performance. Neymar's taken a knock. Game is over. Well done, lads. Uh, let's give Killian a little bit of praise. Right, that's job done for the first game. Uh, our next game, oh, we've got three days till we play Atletico Mineiro. So hopefully we will have, oh, Neymar's injured. Oh, he's out for a couple of days. I might, might rest him, but he's playing against a Brazilian team. I kind of want him to play. Well, unfortunately, he isn't going to be fit enough to start the game. We're having to make quite a few changes. We've got a lot of tired players in the, in the squad. And these are the final games that round out the group stage. There's not a lot riding on m most of them. Uh, Liverpool, if they get a point against Ulsan, will go through. Um, they'll smash them, obviously. Flamengo and Juve is the one that could really... Um, cause problems. It's turned into a bit of a Champions League. Uh, Bayern, Tottenham, United and Barcelona are already through. Real Madrid are already through. Uh, Flamengo and Juve um, right at the bottom there. They're locked on three points but uh, Flamengo have a massive goal difference advantage so they'll need a point but you would imagine uh, Juve will come through that. Atletico Mineiro need to beat us because they only drew 2-2 uh, with America so I, I thought they'd win that. And they haven't done. Um, so as long as we don't lose, we are through. Uh, unfortunately, it's only one game at a time, which is a bit annoying. Um, we have had games. Juventus are out. Juve are out. Flamengo have beaten them. Um, Palmeiras have won 6-0 in their game. But that was already that was already sorted, that group, wasn't it? Real Madrid were already through. Uh, so it'll be Real Madrid against Flamengo. In the quarter final, you'll have Barcelona against Man United and Bayern against Tottenham. And as things stand, it's Boca, but it won't be. It will not be Boca. Um, yeah, we'll keep scouting Gio Reyna. Love that. Right. It's telling me to make seven changes. I am, even my goalkeeper's knackered. I mean, I don't understand how he's not, how he's tired, but I am going to change him. I was debating it but it'll give Ariola a chance I mean look we've we've already had to make um, Stones, Kazawa, Locatelli, Sarabia and Coman have all come in to start and now the goalkeeper um, Kings of Coman wanted by Man United keep your hands off he's French I need him for registration um, and we've got loads of players that would struggle to see out the game I think I'm going to give is Ander Herrera fit 
He is. So I'm going to put him in for Florentino Luis. Um, and I could probably... I could probably... Because the problem is, if you if you take too many... If you leave too many tired players on, you're going to be struggling towards the end. At least now. I mean, I could play Cardi as well, but I want Mbappe to play. And if, if I have to take him off at half-time, but he's got a couple of goals, that's fine. That's not an issue. Um, but I want him to start the match. Icardi will get minutes today, though. Right, let's pump the fist. We all need a point. Maybe shouldn't have said that. Okay, what are they playing? 4-2-3-1. Fair play, boys. Fair play. Right, early encourage. How are their how are their players looking? Ah, oh, every time I do, I go to change that drop down. It brings up highlight. Oh no 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 no! Presnell, what were you doing? Terrible effort from Hulk. Terrible play from Kim Pembe. I mean, what are you doing? Trod on the ball, and then got himself in a right mess. But it's a terrible shot. He's on his left foot. It's his strongest foot, Hulk. We got away with that. Um, oh God, how are they all so fit? Jeez. Another little encourage. Fire them up. Come on, lads. The point's good. A point takes us through. Everson. We're not in the game. Right, because I was won it. Coleman passed his man well. Oh, giving it away though. Oh, that was a fierce back pass. Sarabia, Paredes, Sarabia. Nice ball into space for Cancelo. Oh, God, come on. Oh, you should have had that. Otero. Hits the shot and Ariola holds on. Cancelo's probably going to have to come off at half time looking at him. We are getting dominated here. Whoa, what was that? Was that a shot? Was that a cross? It's a bit disjointed from making. I mean, I've made a lot of changes and it, it's showing. It's very disjointed. The partnerships aren't there. We're just giving it away under no pressure whatsoever. And we're a goal down. Well, this is going to be short-lived, isn't it? It's a deserved goal. It's a well-worked goal. But we're just giving the ball away constantly under no pressure whatsoever. Mbappe's going to have to come off at half-time. Cancelo's going to have to come off. I don't understand why my players are all so knackered and theirs aren't. Right, we've had a couple of shots. The shot count has gone up a little bit for us. Hopefully that's a bit of a sign. Mbappe to Sarabia. Go on, Mbappe. Put him on, put him on his way. Put him on his way. Oh, you've ruined it. The problem is a lot of my subs are tired as well, which is an issue. Here's Paredes. Sarabia. What? <sighs> wow. That's more like it, boys. A goal out of absolutely nothing from Mbappe. But I mean, this pass into midfield here from Sarabia. I mean, what the hell is that? I mean, Martinez should have had that from Locatelli. I wonder... He's been booked. I wonder if he just pulls out of that. And it allowed Locatelli to get... Look, you just, I just wonder because he's been booked, Martinez. I just wonder if he pulled out of that challenge a little bit. It's an emphatic finish from Mbappe, but... Oh, God, look at all those players. They are knackered. Right, I'm just going to pause it. What are their players looking like? How? 
How are all your players? You must not play any sort of tempo whatsoever. Um, I'm going to just calmly say I'm not happy. Mbappe off for Ricardi. Cancelo off for Hisai. And I, I'm going to... What have we got? We have got a higher tempo. Maybe if we drop that down, go a little bit lower, will that, will that help? See, it's only on slightly, I mean, we're not, we just take the tempo down a little bit. I mean, we're not that high paced, I didn't think. Right, here's Coleman. Oh, and card is in. What the hell was that from the keeper? Oh, Nando Herrera's put it wide. The keeper just flew out there. Genuinely thought I was going to see the, the first time I've seen a goalkeeper get sent off. He flew out of his goal. Oh, Ariola with the save. I was going to say, Sasha looked offside there. Right, let's encourage. Paredes is down in the red. Now he's Kimpembe as well. And Coleman. I can't take them all off. Oh, I don't even want to look at that anymore. They are, they are knackered. Paredes, Sarabia. Oh, come on. Oh, yes. Absolutely thumped home by Leandro Paredes. It's an absolute wonder goal and it, we needed it. Boy, did we need that. It's a beautiful hit. Right in that corner. Keeper had no chance. I mean, who do I take off? Well, it's more like who can I bring on, actually? Who's actually fit? Diallo. I could bring a centre-back on. Which probably isn't a bad idea. And that is it. That's all I can do. Oh, God. But it gives us some... Oh, no. I was going to say, it gives us some stability at the back. It gives us some fresh legs and it's 2-2. Two -two. Why are you still telling me to make changes? I can't do it. I didn't need to see a highlight. Paredes. This shouldn't have been this nervy. Icardi, you scored, but for some reason he's injured. But we're 3-2 up. All these players on red, and it's Icardi, one of the ones that can still walk. He's got pulled knee ligaments. Wow. Just popped up on the screen. He's got pulled knee ligaments. Well, I mean, to be fair, with pulled knee ligaments, he hadn't half fired that one in. Right, will a focus work? Did it work? Did anything happen from that? Did it even... <laughs> no idea. I mean, we are... This is the first game I can remember as winning when we pretty much F FMing it, to be honest. Oh, it's a lovely ball. Oh, God. There's still time. What a finish from Hulk. Since that chance in the first half, we haven't even seen him. Lovely ball. What a finish. Ariola making a bit of a tit of himself there, though. Oh, it's Kazawa, isn't it? Right there that plays him on. 
Let's encourage. I don't want to stress them out. So much red. And I mean, I've never seen it that red. I mean, that is very, very low. But we've got through with a 3-3 draw. What an epic match. What an epic match. I thought that that was going to be a premature end to this week. Um, I mean, if we'd have gone out in a group, I might not have even released this episode. Uh, do, I do just want to move on. So we have... Oh, how long's the cardio? Two to three weeks. Oh. We've got one game left to go, haven't we? Right, let me just get through this press conference. Hopefully it shouldn't take long. Wasn't too impressed with our defending. I, yep, it's none of their business. He picked a player of the match. Ariola. Wow. Uh, don't care. Right. We've got one game to go, I think. Look, the Champions League is already going as well. Oops. Oh, Liverpool won 6-0. So we are playing Liverpool. What a surprise. <laughs> what a surprise. So we've got Bayern against Spurs, United against Barca, PSG against Liverpool and Real Madrid against Flamengo. Um, it's a semi-final path. Yes, it is. So we will play Real Madrid or Flamengo in the semi-final if we get past Liverpool. So the plan for the next episode is that we do, fingers crossed, quarter-final and semi-final. And then hopefully at the end of the week it would be the final. But there's a lot to get through there, isn't there? I mean, it is basically a Champions League plus a special guest from South America. Um, but that was an epic. That was an epic. Not for good reasons either. <laughs> but smash a like on it for me, guys. 12 goals. That's not bad, is it? Smash a like. Uh, hit subscribe. Turn on the notifications. And join me for hopefully, hopefully, two matches in the next episode. I'll see you for it. Thanks for watching.